Today I am going to discuss about the topic of tennis elbow so before I start my presentation I would like to all viewers to like share and subscribe my YouTube channel to get the latest update about upcoming videos so let us start with the presentation of tennis elbow. Tennis elbow is a pathological condition of the tist extensor muscle at their origin on the lateral epicondyle. Tennis elbow is also known as lateral epicondylitis is a condition in which the outer part of the elbow become painful and tender. Pain may be also extend into the back of the forearm and grip strength may be weak. This condition is very common in 30 years of age or older than incidents affecting men and women equally. Dominant arm is commonly affected with the prevalence of one third percent in general population, but this increase of 19% in 30 to 60 age of group patients. This picture shows humerus and this is the lateral epicondyle of humerus and tennis elbow there will be pain and inflammation in this region. Latest see about the causes of lateral epicondyle. There will be classified deposit with the common extensor tendon. Patients complains pain of neurological origin like cervical spine affection radial nerve entrapment. Some activities like tightening a screw using a wrench wringing washed clothes vigorous hand shake back hand stroke overhead smash forehand volley poor stroke techniques. What are the clinical features of lateral epicondyle? Patient complains pain on the outer part of the elbow lateral epicondyle. There will be a point of tenderness over the lateral epicondyle, a permanent part of the bone on the outside of the elbow. Some risk factors include pain from gripping and movement of the wrist, especially wrist extension, e.g. turning a screwdriver, wringing washed clothes, and lifting movements for a long period of time. What are the pathophysiology and related symptoms of lateral epicondyle? Stage 1 There is acute inflammation, but no angioblastic inversion patient complain of pain during activities. Stage 2 This is the stage of chronic inflammation, there is a some angioblastic inversion patient complain of pain both during daily activities and at rest position. Stage 3 Chronic inflammation with extensive and angioblastic inversion patient complain pain at rest night pain and pain during daily activities. How to treat tennis elbow? Anti-inflammatory drugs local injection of hydrocortisone. Home remedies for tennis elbow. First wrap some ice cubes in a thin towel. Then rest your elbow on the pillow or other cushioned area. Then place the towel gently on the affected area and leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes. Then repeat several times a day until the pain is gone. Thank you for watching my video. For any other information you can message me on my Insta ID First Physio.